Uh, hello everyone, Homo Oblivion back here once again, playing some more uh, Fallout Tale Two Wastelands. When uh, when I when I still when I continued stumbling through the game last time, I had just finished Robco, and also the only place I got left is Rivet City, for uh, fall is the Wasteland Survival's Guide, but on. Fortunately, getting through there, I kind of have to pass through GNR to do that. I know there's other ways to get there, but it's going to take a lot uh, longer time, and probably it's a lot easier for me to shoot from uh, shoot from uh, GNR and that stuff. However, I just remembered something I should be picking up, and uh, this also involves me going back towards Tenpenny Tower, which will kind of make the next area a little easier except for the battle of gnr which could be a little bit more problematic than anything so the first thing i'm going to do is i'm going to exit here there we go now i have tried to uh get the graphics a little less muddled uh one good thing about this is i now have a better viewing uh pit boy so the uh bottom things here are not all muffled so it still looks okay and before anyone says anything i've been going through and just adjusting stuff around the best i can so sometimes uh sometimes you gotta take what you can get on this stuff also i have tried to get the uh try to figure out how to get the uh nmc uh texture packs uh in detail to wastelands there's re there's ways to do so but for some reason, it just doesn't agree with me, Welcome. or it doesn't agree with some of the uh, some of the uh, uh, textures in the game. So yeah, I got friends that are gonna try work on it. If they can get it working decently enough, then I will give it a shot. But until then, um, I think I also need to go up to Moira's and uh, see what I can get for ammo. Because honestly, I am low on low on ammo. I have been for a while. Mora, you better have something for me. Oh hey, oh, watch your step. I think one of my test subjects got loose. Oh, but don't worry, it's probably harmless. <laughs> now I'm worried. Uh, what do you got? Sure. I, I need some ammo. I need ammo, ammo, ammo. That's what I need. Uh, what do you got for, uh, not a whole hell of a lot. Looks like you got more melee than anything. Uh, metal armor? Nope, nope. Uh, do you have any... No, you do not have any stim packs. This does not bode well for me getting ammo. Uh, let's see what I've got. I've got, oh, do we have any 32 ammo? Does not look like it. Oh, freaking fantastic. Um, all right. Well, anyways, let me see what I can do here. Oh, and uh, last game, I actually picked up a pair of night vision goggles. So any dark places is actually going to be a lot easier on me. So that's a good thing. Uh, good. That's actually the blood packs will actually help me out a little bit. Um, what can I sell? No, I'm probably going to need that. Um, miscellaneous. Oh, right. I still got some stuff here. I could probably sell. Yep, I do. And two cartons of cigarettes. And uh, let's see if there's anything else here. Nope, but I will sell that. I will exit Good hunting. and say goodbye for now, because I'm gonna res I'm gonna reset all that. And also, I've got three scrap metal to send up here. That is, if he's around. Sometimes trying to find him is a pain in the neck. Oh, hey, yeah. Walter. What is it? Uh, interested in buying scrap metal. Uh, here. Well, all right. Let me count out your caps. There we go. We got some more caps. Uh. 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 There's days I wish I was in Vegas, and then I could probably find some decent places to get some get some ammo. But for the time being, I'm gonna have to just roll down the side and see what happens. Because I'm going to roll this 24 hours and then 24 hours again because this is kind of how it's kind of how, how it usually goes with uh, trying to deal with this bullshit. And 24. 
So uh, for any uh, anyone who wants to know about my notifications on when I go live, because this is being this is being streamed live on twitch.tv slash Puma Oblivion, you can check my Twitter at Puma Oblivion to uh, to find out when I'm going to be streaming and uh, and notification when I go live. So uh, yeah, that should uh, give you uh, b better ideas than what I usually do. I am going to roll I'm going to roll 48 on this one. I definitely need ammo, but I really don't want to. I really want to make sure I've got ammo for at least some of my guns, namely my silenced pistol, because I know I'm probably going to need that to uh, get into some of these places. So we will see what happens. I'm not going to make any promises because uh, this is going to be coming a pain in the neck. Right. Dog meat. Thank you. It's good to see you alive and well. Get your doggy butt out of my way. Right now, hopefully Moira's uh freaking stores of inventory has restocked. Any luck finding out how Rivet City got started? Um, no. Try asking around a bit. You never know who's collected a lot of information. Yeah, um, I need to find out if your, uh, if your ammo has, uh, fixed up yet. Uh, this is not a good sign. Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Don't I have a, what, don't I have a police pistol with 350? Okay, that's 357. All right. So I have a Scorp 44. Apparently there's no... Wow, really? You're going to give me absolutely nothing. Uh, what do I have for ammo? Nothing for the 32. I've got 46. Uh, my assault rifle I could probably use a little bit. Uh, the combat shotgun I can use a little. I got a little for the piece, police pistol. I got 12 shots for that. I got 145 shotgun shells, but I'd rather use the combat shotgun. But I'm waiting for next level so I can actually use that legitly. Because apparently I only have a strength of 5. Uh, right. Um, no, we'll just keep the silence 10 mil for now. Uh. Have fun out there, okay? Yeah, I'm gonna have all the fun. Ugh. I'm gonna die horribly. All right. So, uh, let's, uh, go roll out of here and, uh, oh yeah. What's happening? I know what I gotta do here now. So. With this, we are now going to head towards Tenpenny Tower. You can tell Tenpenny he can kiss my ass. We've got plenty of bottle caps. Let me in, goddammit. How many times do we have to go through this? You're not getting in. I can stand here all day yelling at you through this damn speaker if I... Considering who lives here, it ain't gonna I'm do you any good, buddy. Tenpenny won't allow zombies to live here. Who the hell are you calling a zombie? You're definitely not human. That's for damn sure. For the last time, no zombies allowed. Can't you tell the difference between me and a feral? Fine. I'll show you the goddamn difference. Just you wait. You'll get yours. All of you. So, yeah. There's no racism in this game. Yeah, but unfortunately, it's for humans and ghouls, so, yeah. I thought I told you to get the hell out of here. Tenpenny doesn't want your goddamn caps, and I don't want the goddamn headache. For the last time, get your rotten, ugly, goddamn ghoul ass off Mr. Tenpenny's private property. Uh, is that how you treat all your guests? What? No, just those damn ghouls. Sorry. Thought you were one of them. Ghoul or not, I must inform you that you are trespassing on Alistair Tenpenny's private property. Renders an official business only. I can take care of that little ghoul problem for you. Is that so? And why should I believe that? You ever kill a ghoul before? Uh, I killed so many ghouls, I've stopped counting. And I'm not wrong. Is that so? Then I'm sure you can handle your... Uh, 
Maybe you'd accept this hundred caps as insurance of my good behavior. Perhaps you'll fit in around here better than I thought. All right. I'll take your money. But don't press your luck. I got my eye on you. Don't bother Tenpenny or the other residents. If you so much as sneeze in the wrong direction, I'll gut you. Ah, well, I'm down to minus 100, 100 caps. Welcome to ten pin Yeah, I ain't gonna do anything stupid. Oh, yeah, Chief Gustavo. Lovely. All right, well... I know one thing I'm gonna have to do here, but, uh... I don't think my pickpocketing is going to be that great. Come on, Gustavo. Let's go in and chat. Hello. Wait a minute. I came in here before Mr. Gustavo, or is he still at the... Oh, he's at the desk already. All right. Well, okay. This better be important. Uh, how's that ghost situation come along? Phillips won't take no for an answer. Keep showing up. Looking for a handout. Keenest kind of wanted. End of story. If I were a betting man, I'd place a stack of caps on him trying something violent soon. And that would make Tenpenny nervous. I don't like it when Tenpenny gets nervous. But I can't spare the manpower to go hunt down Roy Phillips and his band of misfits. Or I'd gladly end this thing once and for all. Perhaps the residents could be persuaded to let the ghouls live here. Have you ever tried list talking to the ghouls? I bet you can work something out. What's the hell a ghoul anyway? Some kind of diseased human? You serious? A goddamn disaster waiting to happen. That's what they are. Sure, maybe you can get over the fact that they look like someone took a cheese grater to their face. But it's what you don't see that's the problem. The radiation slowly eats away their brain. Then they go zombie on you. It's better for everyone to kill them before all that, if you ask me. Oh, my lord. Tenpenny doesn't care how big their pile of bottle caps is. He won't let ghouls live here. Those ghouls need to give up and go bother someone else. Whatever, it's not really much. No. I can help you with that ghoul problem. Where are they hiding now? Really? You? You're welcome to give it a try. But don't come crying to me when you get hurt. Oh, by the way. They hold up in the nearby metro tunnels. They're living with packs of feral ghouls. Be careful. <sighs> damn close to turning zombie himself. I suppose you won't be doing this out of the kindness of your heart, hmm? How's 500 bottle caps sound? Payable upon termination of that damn ghoul, Roy Phillips, and all his followers. I'll take it. Any offer? Any other help you can offer? Here, you can take this rifle and ammo, but don't waste it shooting at shadows. Roy Phillips and his gang are somewhere in Warrington Station Metro Tunnels. They've barred the main entrance. Try going through the train yard. Oh, did you just give me a Chinese? Oh, well, need a tick. What do we got here? Apparel. Federalist Lounge. Nope. I just remember this place actually has Boutique Le Chic. Why not? Let's talk to this one. Welcome to Boutique La Chic. I'm Lydia Montenegro, proprietor. Here you'll find only the best, with a price tag you can boast about to your friends. Uh, nice place you have here. Your taste in shopping venue is impeccable. How may I assist you? Um, I like to do some business with you. My boutique has many unique items for the discerning customer. And you actually have some shit I wouldn't mind having. Ammo. All right, 308. Wait a minute. Nope, I need my guns out. Okay. Th Sun's out, guns out. 308. Um, yeah, I'll take all those. 
I'll take the armor piercings as well, and those, and those, and those, and those. Yes, definitely those. 40 out buck, dragon's breath, the shet rounds, slugs. Oh, I'm gonna have to hold off on that. I wouldn't mind those uh, 556 ammos, and uh, let's see what else we got here. All right, so first things first, we'll, we'll buy all that. Oh, hey, they just give me another 112 caps. Mighty nice of you. We'll buy those. And buy all the hollow points. All that. Oh, I'm a little short. All right, well, let's see what else I can do here. I can sell some... I can sell one of my hydras. That works. Now I'm broke. Uh, Puma's now broke. <laughs> all right. It's been a pleasure doing business. Pleasant day to you, dear. So, everything's working out pretty good right now. Let's hope... Um, oh, yeah. This is gonna be fun trying to deal with this bullshit. Alright. So, I now have a few more few more amp pieces of ammo. Um, and at this moment, I'm now gonna switch my, data, my quest over to Tempenny Tower. Up. Oh. And then we're going to head this way. Uh, I am not liking this run at all. But, it would be a lot worse. But, there is a reason why I'm doing this. And, uh, let's hope that, uh, I can manage this. I can manage this stuff. So... The royal pain the ass about all this is... Ooh, there's some freaking buildings over there. I might have to check those, check those later, but first things first. And now we're going into the ghoul territory. Let's put the guns... At, let's take my gun out. This is warranty train yard. Oh. Oh. Oh, Jesus, of course. Where are you? There you are. No, not dog meat yet. Oh, my lord. Gotta love that bloody mess. Gotta love that bloody mess. Alright. So. And warrant and tunnels. Now, here's where everything's gonna get even worse. Alright, dog meat. We're gonna try to do this. Okay. We're going to try to do this as carefully as possible. And as many people know, I usually try to go up on this shit. Um... Uh, boy, here we go again. Okay, let's just keep going. I'm not seeing anything, but it looks like this is only one path leading down here. Stealth is not my strong suit, and I've also got to keep an eye out. Sons of bitches like that. Yeah, I just barely caught the eye of that one. Alright. Much as I hated using, using those ghouls, uh, well, this is good. Wait a minute. Is that cool? What is that? I can't really tell from here. Nope, that's not cool. All right, so we're gonna just continue on here. Doesn't look like anything. I'm gonna cross the uh, cross this here. What should I need to uh, get up into here?
Ping ping. How the hell did they find me? They did. Well, that worked. All right. Take a look here. Nothing here. Red X impact. Yeah, I'll take the expireds as well. Um, leather belts, nitrogen. I don't have a cry. I don't want to use a cry later on this one. Uh, let's just go this way slow. Five more bottle caps. Uh, check these things. Nothing. Five, five, six rounds. Always appreciated. Lunchbox. Let's uh, creep down this road. Oh, you know what? Better idea. Let's go night vision. There we go. There we go. Little night vision. Never hurt anybody. Except for maybe these suits. Okay. And now... Hang on, dog meat. There's still more here. Okay, we're still in caution. But if they're going anywhere, they're over this way. Dog meat, you really don't want to get my get in my way right now. And turn the corner. Air, turn this corner and there. Move this side. Now oh, there's doors on that side. Doors on that side. Aha. I think I might have found somebody. Come on, buddy. There you are. <laughs> and yeah, dead. Yeah, dead. Yeah, dead. Yeah, dead. That worked. So there was one in that door. Let's check. Uh, let's creep around to this door. Doesn't look like anything. Check out this. Let's roll around here. Take a look. Okay. So there's nothing there. Uh, let's check out here. Okay. So let's check here. Oh, rules got gaps. All right. So it looks like if there's any other rules, it'll be this one. Hey, dog, me, be quiet. I'm trying to be stealthy. Got him. All right. That's. Oh. Oh, there's another. Five caps. Five, five, six, and. Oh, I was waiting for that. Seventy five. 60, 50, and 28. This one, however, we are going intense training because we need that one point in strength. And now, if I've done this correct, there we go. And now we're going to uh, continue using the uh, Tim, but we now have a Chinese assault rifle we can use, a sniper rifle we can use. So everything's coming to Puma right now. Um, oh, I'll take that extra assault rifle. Why? Because I can actually do this. Boom. 
Nope, that is actually I cannot use that. So we will pair that one. Beautiful. And now, uh, let's see here. Yes, we are going in the right direction. I need to keep my eye out because there's always somebody trying to creep around the back side of this bullshit. Alright, buddy. Now, why are you getting in the way? Okay. Roamer's down. Good. Load. Come across. Open the door. Oh. Ah, shit! Oh, I crap pulled his head. Well, that's a bloody mess waiting to happen. Right. Ten mils only as good as what I have for it. Uh oh. Good. Uh, that's what I was like to see. One little bullet to the head, and everything's dealt with. Okay. Now let's see if Roy is uh willing to chat. Let's see if Roy's well in the chat. You there. Put your weapons away. Come over here. No funny bit. Alright. I'll put my gun away. I got no problems with that. I got no problems with that. What are you doing here? It's not I'm here to see Roy. Oh yeah? Is he ex So what are you doing in the Metro Tunnels? I've been stomping around with Roy and his gang of misfits. Roy's a no-nonsense, take-no-prisoners kind of guy. He heard about this tenpenny asshole, and now he's trying to get us in that tower. He's hatching some kind of plan to kill all those bigot bastards. Believe it or not, I used to vacation there. Huh. So tell me what it's like being a ghoul. I wasn't always like this. I was a goddamn scientist. We were doing great things. Amazing things. Sure, sacrifices were required. Some people got hurt, but we were making real progress. But then those goddamn bombs dropped. Karma's a real bitch. You'd be wise to remember that. Always good to know. Goodbye. Live it up while it lasts. Yep, no problem. What the hell do you want? Figures. He's Tenpenny's adorable lapdog, isn't he? So what's your angle in all this? Relax. It's just a warning, not a threat. I'm not going to kill you. That's awfully decent of you. Even if we already knew those bigoted bastards wanted us dead. Talk to Roy Phillips. You might be able to help us out. That's what I'm planning on doing. Good luck. Yeah, I know. I'm gonna... What the hell do you want? Oh, Jesus. Nothing. Bye. Good luck. Alright, let's go talk with Roy. Let's see, uh... Wait a minute. Is it in here? Nope. I gotta keep going this way. Wait a minute. Oh. He's downstairs. Of course he is. Oh. He's downstairs. So, um, I'm just gonna go, uh... So, apparently he lives down this way? Alright. No, when you see a baby critter like that, you keep your distance. That's ah, in here. All right. 
Is it in here? No, it's not. Oh, no, it is. It's just further down this way. Come on, Roy. We gotta talk. Don't want to start any more bullshit. Oh, he's... Uh, he's sleeping? Roy! Roy, I, I need to talk to you, buddy. He shouldn't be sleeping. You there. Hold it. Who the hell are you? Yeah, nothing to worry about. I'm harmless. harmless? Well, you're lucky I don't stick you and take your shit. Watch yourself. We don't take kindly to strangers. So what are you doing in the metro tunnels? Biding our time, making plans, getting ready. Tenpenny and his pack of elitist wannabes can't keep us out of that tower forever. We've got rights, and we'll take them if they aren't given to us. Hmm. I might be able to get you in there. I already got a plan. They think I'm a monster? I'll show them the real monsters. We'll unleash our feral brethren on them. All those bigoted sons of bitches will get torn apart. Trouble is getting past the damn subway access door. You see, there's some kind of escape door that leads from the Tenpenny basement to the subway tunnels. There must be some way to get that open. Right on. Kill those elitists. I think I can help you with the escape door. Now you're talking my language. All right, here's the plan. I'll gather up a horde of ferals and wait for you by that escape door. You find a way to get it open, and then we'll sit back and enjoy the show. Oh, this is gonna be fun. Indeed. Remember, I'll be waiting for you to get that door open. Don't keep me waiting long, kid. Um... I killed a bunch of crazy ghouls in the metro tunnels. So you killed a bunch of ferals? I got no compassion left for those mindless freaks. But they were a nice deterrent keeping out smooth-skinned bastards like yourself. Ah, fair enough. All right, I'll talk to you later. Hurry up. Those bigots got big comeuppance waiting for them. I mean to give it to them soon. Now get. Right, right, I'm getting, I'm getting. I'm getting, I'm getting, good lord. Well, hopefully I don't have to go all the way back around. Hey there. Uh, nope, I don't. Um, let's see here, there's a hundred. Okay. There is the metal gate. Oh, there's 23. Oh! Hold on, can I go out the other side and actually not have to worry about, uh... And not have to worry about, uh, going all the way through the sub, the sewers again? That'd be nice. Um, let's see here. I think, yeah, it's up there. Okay. So, let's go. Because I am more than willing to do this bullshit. And before anything else happens, I'm not taking no damn chances on this shit. Because you never know when the thing is going to be a, going to be a pain in the ass. All right, so world map. Tenpenny Tower. We will go to Tenpenny Tower. All right, so. Give me a second. Keep your panties on. I don't, I'm a guy. I don't have panties on. At least I don't anyways. All right, so. The next thing I need to do is going to be uh, rather tricky. So much so, I gotta do this. Um, what I gotta do? Oh, I know what I was gonna do. I don't need this in here. Alright, so. I am gonna go sneak my ass. Oh, is that? That's not Gustavo. That is not Gustavo. Alright, so. What I'm gonna do now. Is I'm gonna wait. I'm gonna wait. 10 hour no 8 hours and we'll wait here we'll just have a little we'll, we'll have a little chill moment here 6 and 7 all right we now go down and this is why i wanted to keep that stealth boy all right dog meat let's see what we can do 
it in, and now we're gonna have five. It's quick save and oh, and yes. And we yeah. out. And now we go this way. Do 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 Okay, let's see what we can do here. All right, and uh, DT DCTA emergency access terminal. Boom. Now all these assholes will be resting in peace. And as soon as I do this. Um, uh, first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna do a stress call to the DCTA because I know it's not gonna work. Yup. Unleash the Pharaoh Hounds. <laughs> Great job, kid. Meet me around front. I have something for you to keep the Pharaohs from gnawing on your ass. Alright. And I'm just gonna go... Pull out my pistol. Oh, I'm still in stealth. All right, well, let's get going. Ooh, ooh, ooh. And the ferals are already busy. Yeah, I'm going to lose a lot of karma, but right now I really don't give a shit. I don't care if the, doing it's a peaceful solution was the right way of doing things, but uh, yeah. Hey, Roy. Great job, kid. Here, take this mask. It'll keep you safe from the ferals. Just don't get too close to them, or they'll sniff you out. Don't forget to put it on. Yep, uh, I'm planning on it. Apparel, cool mask. Yep, it removes the combat helmet, but I'm now immune to the ghouls. And getting in the GNR just made a just got a hell of a lot easier. So uh, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna open in. I'm just gonna chill. I'm gonna enjoy kicking the shit out of you. Because here is where we start pilfering. <laughs> yes. Time to continue trying to begin the pilfering of this place of all of its goods. <laughs> but I'm not gonna go all the way up to ten pennies tap. All the way to ten penny tower. No, no, no. Uh oh, Anthony Ling. Oh! You're dead! Oh, easy there, buddy. Anthony Link. Inventory key. Yup. Bottle cap. Uh, let's see what else is here. Bottle cap. Oh. Bottle cap. Um. Yeah, I know, dog meat. This is not the best thing in the world, but um, let's be honest. Uh, I have a feeling we'll probably be doing just fine. Oh, wow. Okay. Oh, Boutique Le Chic, huh? No, I'm not that mean. I'll just let the ghouls handle you. I'll just let the ghouls hand it, handle you, too. Yep, more coming. Uh, let's see. Cash register. Locked hard. Oh, well. I'll take I'll take all your processed foods here. Actually, I'll take anything that I can get. I can't I can take it for anything that's not nailed down. Uh just because I feel like it. Alright, well. I'm out of here. Yeah, that ain't gonna go well for you. 
All right, well, karma's a bitch, bit. Karma's a bitch. I don't care if I lost karma from that. Yeah, I'm vilified for this group, but most of the most of the place is not going to be even worth a freaking headache. All right, boutique of chic inventory. Uh, yes. I'm a good guy. I'm not a nice guy. And thanks for my money back. Search. The multi for Okay, that's not... Okay, so nothing there. Ooh. I don't care. Let's see what else we can find here that might actually be even worth it. Ooh. Yes. And we're done. And I'm not even going to bother with the rest of this shit. Good enough. Yeah, I'm vilified by the fuck. Go get him, boys! Uh, the answer is no, Margaret Primrose. Wait a minute, is that Gustavo? Yes, it is! Hey, Gustavo, you deep piece of shit! You're dead. So apparently there's an asshole over here because I'm vilified and they don't care for me. No, they don't care for me anymore, do they? Well, guess what? I got bullets in the head for ya! Bullets to the head! Bullets to the bullets! Well, hey boys. I'll let this, I'll let this mess go on. As far as I'm concerned, as far as I'm concerned, have fun, boys. I got what I wanted. <laughs> uh, yep. So, since we're outside here, we do not need the ghoul helmet, but we just got to make sure that we uh, get it for later on. And now, back to Megaton. We're actually liked a lot more than those assholes now. <laughs> All right. So, that job's done, and now I have something to circumvent uh, a good amount of the enemies that are in the sewers and kill them for free XP. Hi, Moria. Any luck finding out how Rivet City got started? Uh... Um, I'll get a straight answer. I can't get a straight answer to these folks. Try asking around a bit. You never know who... Yeah, um, when I get over there, Moira, I have not even gotten close to getting over there. All right. Absolutely. Yep, all right. Hey, you got more... Yay, you got more ammo. Oh, yes, I need all those 32s. I want those as well. Uh, wait a minute. Okay, let's go to my weapons. The police pistol is 357. Oh, Okay, so I don't have any 44s here. That's fine. Uh, hollow points. Uh, I don't have 45, do I? Nope, all I have is scope 44. We'll take all those. We'll take all those. We'll take all those. I don't need the 20s for anything. We don't need 9 mils. And... Oh, we do need all this, though. Good. All right. And now, we'll go see what you got for it. Oh, you got a recharger rifle. Shame I'm not using energy weapons, or I would be all over that. Um, leather armor reinforced. No. Uh, stimpaks. 
still going to need those. I could make go up to Matresti Station and uh, sell those. That would be worth it. And uh, let's see if there's anything else here. Yeah, there's a couple of things here I probably could grab, but I think I'm just going to uh, just leave Good it to hunting. that. Good luck. Right. So we now have uh, everything that we need. Um, I'm also going to check my karma status because I have a funny feeling I'm probably not as uh, great as what I was. No, I'm still a defender even with all that karma loss. <laughs> After all of that karma loss. Oh, wow. Uh, right. Let's go. Okay. First thing I'm going to do is I'm going to make a little side trip. To Northwest Seneca... Because this is where I can go to, uh... Because this is where I can go to talk to the buddy who's making Ultra Jet. So I can sell, so I can sell off these, uh... So I can sell off these things to him. Hey, Murphy! So, what did you bring me? Oh, uh... Here, it's all the sugar bombs I've got. Nice work. Three bombs removed. 45 bottle caps acquired. Easiest 45 caps ever made. And hell, consider everything. That's profit! Alright. So. I think at this point in time, we need to start thinking about getting our asses over to GNR. Right. Uh, because that, I can't do anything until Rivet City. We're saying survival guys, Rivet City. Uh, big trouble in Big Town is not for my uh, is not for my level, at least not yet. And following in his footsteps is where I'm going now, and this leads me right over here. There's Super Duper Mart, and apparently on the other side is another area to lead to the GNR building. So. So I would say, let's head to Super Duper Mart. Oh, hey. Wait a minute. Are these guys escape slavers? Nope, they're wastelanders. All right. Well, you know what? I'm just going to let you go do your thing. And I'm just going to stroll this way. Ah, okay. So, I just got to go across the water here someplace. Ooh, I don't need to go across the water someplace. I can do it right here. Yep. Let's go. All right. And nothing that I can see at the moment, but this definitely will... Give me a better outlook on where I'm going. Any enemies ahead? Does not look like it. Bar got west. All right. Now, let me see here. Oh, is that enemies? I don't know. That's a raid. Okay. Fair enough. But uh, I can actually uh, do something about this. Yes, I definitely can do something about this. And... Well, that kind of worked. Um, and now we're going to go... Uh, oh, well, first thing we're going to do is going to repair that. There we go. And we're going to go back to Sounds 10 mil. And then at this point, since I'm out of civilization, back to the ghoul mask. It is time 
The Brave, the GNR bullshit. Let's go, bitches. Up goes the mole rat. Up <laughs> goes the mole rat. Uh oh. Let's go this way. Oh, there's another mole rat. Get him! Get him, dog meat! Go get him, dog meat! Good boy! The GNR outpost. All right. Dog meat with a freaking goddamn stealth kill. Oh, love it. All right, let's go up this way. And all right, hey boys. Um, I'll get I'll get I'll get with you in a moment because seriously, it's not going to end up uh, going very well for you. Uh, let's see. Right away, impact friendship metro. Hey, there we go. And oh, let's see what we can learn from this place. Oh, uh, this place is definitely invested. Maybe inspired. Maybe immersed. Wow. Uh, do I have to chastise this bullshit? Nope. Um, I think I can't handle the pressure. Nope. Oh, Jesus Christ. This is stemming into something I'm not going to like. All right. Huh. Dud removed. Dud removed. Uh, I need... Oh, hang on. Lounces were banished. Okay. So, stemming was... Uh, um... How about... Am I still standing? Oh. Nope. Okay. Um, am I still sleeping? Nope. Am I stealing everything? Yes, I am. <laughs> That's one of the things I always do when I'm doing these things. It's like, can I just... Okay. Um, unlock security safe. Uh, MDCA. Due to class 7 systems failure. A nuclear war. All service engineers are required to report for duty. Failure... Re to report will result in termination per clause of 45.7a of the maintenance service union contract have a pleasant work day well unfortunately i don't think any of them showed up because they were all dead <laughs> uh no i'm not gonna begin the game the gas main flow test i'm sorry uh okay so let's just uh, take a little uh, stroll around here and see if there's anything else we can pick up that might be of any interest. Nope. Nothing? Really? Uh, well, a couple lunch boxes. I'll take those. Uh, anything in the filing cabinets? Nope. Fallout 4. You're te Fallout, you're teasing me with this. Hey, buddies. Yeah, don't mind me. I'm just gonna open this door, and uh, if you don't mind me, guys, I'll be I'll be moving along. Besides, I've got a couple of things I gotta do anyway. So, oh, wait a minute. Nope. Door over here. Hey, buddy. Don't mind me. Don't mind me. Don't mind me. I'm just I'm just plotting along here. Just trying to be... All right, Tentley Town Friendship Station. I got to go stealth here. All right, because I have a feeling that starting here, I'm going to be starting meeting up with some other things. Other than ferals. Coca-Cola. Oh, everything's coming up. Quantum. Holy crap. Okay. 
And uh, let's see here. Nothing. All right. And path that way looks like looks blocked, so we will go with. Hang on. We got oh, we got rat roaches, huh? All right. Well, that's fine. I didn't realize we had rad roaches. All right, well. Oh. There we go. Eh. That's the least of my problems, considering where I'm heading. <laughs> that's why I'm kind of saving my, uh, uh... That's why I'm kind of saving my assault rifle for when I get over to GNR. For obvious reasons. And there's why I'm saved my ammo. That's why I saved my ammo. Uh, we are now in super mutant territory. Oh uh, God, this is not going. So at this point in time, I am now keeping my eye out for any more super mutants. Uh, that's not a super mutant. That's a ghoul. Uh, okay. That super mutant apparently was scared shitless. And now I'm just gonna... Peek down that hole. Okay. Hey, feral ghouls. Uh, no, don't mind me. Don't mind me. Just passing through. I think at this point I'm going to pull up my combat shotgun because I can actually use this without too much of an issue. And uh, where are we going? We are going... Oh, that one. All right. Oh, yeah, that's right. I got to go out. I got to go out this way. So, uh, yeah, this is going to be amusing because uh, we are about to meet up with another group of people. If I remember, if I remember this shit correctly. And, uh, we'll... whoa, Jesus Christ. God damn freaking red roach jumped me out of my freaking boots. Uh, that's what you fucking get. Ah, damn it. All right, more new cola. And if I remember correctly, this is... Yep, this is Chevy Chase. That's the G on our outpost. And now we're going to duck back down again. Discover Chevy Chase North. All right. And now... Hello? Hello? Yep, this is exactly what I thought it was going to be. And I know that there are super mutants in this area. And I'm probably going to be meeting them here in a moment. Yep, there they are. Let's see if I can find this. All right. And now we go back to our combat shotgun and then we go out. All right. Now that's what I'm talking about. All right. Is she ready? You don't need to worry. We're the best outfit. That's how we do it in the Lion's Pride, you fucking freak. Initiate. Shut it. You'll have your fill of death soon enough. Look, I don't know who you are, but you don't belong here. The super mutants have overrun our brothers at the Galaxy News radio building, and we're headed there to back them up. You can tag along if you want, but keep your head down and try not to do anything stupid. Uh, thanks for the assist. I didn't know this place was so dangerous. You've been living under a rock? This is D.C. The entire city is crawling with super mutants. Now, if you'll excuse me. Ah, uh, you guys mentioned something about Galaxy News? Ruins right now. 
but the Galaxy News Radio building is sort of our port in the storm. Unfortunately, the building's been hit pretty hard lately. We're their backup. So if there are no more questions, we really need to move out. All right, then. Watch yourself out there. Well, I'm just going to follow you guys in. On me. You're doing fine. Just follow my lead. No dead heroes today, okay? Thirty two rifle. Okay. What's the situation? All clear, Sentinel. Five mutants released from their torment. The rest are keeping their heads down. Good. Jennings? Negative. A new recruit? Just a stray we picked up. The one that blundered into the uglies over on 42nd. Welcome. All right. It's the usual drill. Redden, you just do whatever Paladin Vargas says and keep your mouth shut. Yes, ma'am. I love these people. <laughs> Okay. Anything up there? Nope. Okay. So at this point, I am now going to grab my combat shotgun. And let's go. Alright. Let's just follow the gang. Let's just follow the gang. All right. No. Yes. Hey, I got that freaking I got that freaking gun out of their hand. That's awesome. Let, let's pull out the, the nine slugs I got. Alright, so, 5.56 five, ammo. Works. What do you have? 5.56. Five, five, hey! Ooh, and another assault rifle. Alright, let's repair this up. Boom. And let's go have some assault rifle fun. Okay, we are almost at GNR Plaza. So this is going to end up being... Uh... Yep, time for the shit! There we go. Um, another super mutant right there. Oh, easy, easy. Armor piercing, huh? There you go. trial run come on lion's pride needs me and you know it that citadel guard duty is such bullshit yeah yeah we'll see now knock that off we're clear out here stand ammo. down ah oh, come on we just kicked combat helmet uh well for the moment we're gonna pop the asses who else and this is where this bad boy comes into play. Those were all the ugly of DC. Humble as all. You take it easy. Great to see you guys. It's been okay. Once we're inside, 
You're telling me. Now well, you're talking. Another mess cleaned up. We'll sweep the perimeter. Short That's a behemoth. And this is why I hate this place. You really don't want me freaking using this here. Oh, well. Fuck. Okay, um yeah, let's use one of the, let's use one of those dumb those bags. And now we're going to go wait a moment and there we go. Got him! Unfortunately, my hands are now crippled again. Well, that's no problem because we're done here. And this is when we go grab another doctor's bag and then we use a couple sim packs. Ah. Uh, God damn. That's annoying. All right. 20 gauge rounds, 9 mils, missiles, Chinese pistols, frag grenades. Oh, wait a minute. Uh, frag grenades. Frag mines. Spike missiles, microfusions. Not much all you need for. Oh, uh, let's uh let's grab a let's grab that. And she proved it here today. Yeah, I know. God damn it. When we get back to the Citadel, I'll talk to the scribes. Let it be chronicled that Paladin Redden passed her test. Come on. Let's see if they've got anything to drink in this town. So this is the point where we now go check everything out. We go see what else is in here. And now we have Galaxy News Radio to open up. Uh, 45 auto. Oh, 45 round, 45 caliber machine gun. All right, well. Looks like it's all clear. Unlocking outer door. There we go. That works. That works lovely. All right. And now we're going to be polite and then enter Galaxy News Radio. Knight Finley at your service. You can head right on up. Okay. All right, folks. Uh, time to meet one of the uh, most pop, one of the most popular uh, uh, voices in Fallout Three. Well, except for Liam Neeson, but. That's another story. And hey, three dog. The look on your face says it all. You're wondering who the heck this guy is and why you should care. Well, prepare to be enlightened. I am three dog, jockey of discs and teller of truths, lord and master over the finest radio station to grace the wastes, Galaxy News Radio. And you, well, I know who you are. Heard about you leaving that vault, traveling the unknown, just like dear old dad, huh? Met him already. Um, you know my father? Is he here? Please, I've been looking for him. Hey, hey, one thing at a time. Nah, your old man ain't here. Not anymore. He heard old uh... Three Dog on the radio. Figured I knew what was what out here in the Capital Wasteland. And he was right, so I filled the old man in. But he split. Looks like I've got my way of contributing to the good fight, and he's got his own. Good fight? What's that all about? Imagine a picture, okay? A picture of the Capital Wasteland. All that brick and rock. A whole lot of nothing, right? There's people out there trying to just barely make it from day to day fighting to stay alive and make something out of what they got. 
but then you've got all kinds of shit. Slavers, super mutants, raiders. They all want a slice of the pie, too. And aim to take it by force. So, you fight the good fight with your voice on Galaxy News Radio. Well, holy shit. Aren't you a chip off the old block? You are as smart as your dad. Since you know all about this cause, no need to explain the effect. Let's get you on your way. How'd you know I was looking for my dad? Oh, come on. You're a spitting image of the guy. He's been here before, and now you're here. Doesn't take a genius to figure it out. You want to find your dad. And it just so happens his location is known to yours truly. But if you want to know more, you're going to have to contribute to the good fight. Shit. I forgot about this little point. Kind of namely because I got to head right into the center of super mutant hell. And my guns ain't going to do me shit in there. Great, I'm going to have to probably roll back the other way and grab more ammo. Uh, uh, what can I ever do for you? You seem to have everything you need here. I have the name and the talent. But what I don't have are people to run out and do the stuff I need. Sure, the Brotherhood watches over the place, yeah. But that's all they can spare. Galaxy News needs a doer. Someone who can go out there into that wild, woolly world and get shit done. So you game? If you know anything that can help my dad, please just tell me. You want to find your dad. And it just so happens his location is known to yours truly. He was here with Galaxy News. We had a great conversation. He's a real stand-up guy. If you want to know more, you're going to have to contribute to the good fight. Uh, by my dad, I'm ready for anything. Good, because this isn't going to be easy. Of course. Galaxy News Radio is my baby. I love it. I feed it. I keep it changed. But there's one problem. No one outside of D.C. can hear her cry. You see, some brainless super mutant thought it would be funny to shoot at the shiny round thing on the Washington Monument. Oh. I see where this is going. Yep, that shiny thing was our broadcast relay. Now it's Swiss cheese. Without it, our broadcast range is quite limited. Of course, the factory that made the relay dishes is long gone, leveled. As in, we're never gonna scavenge that part again. Okay. This is getting to sound risky. No shit! But, I'll do anything to find my dad. Yeah, this is not going to be pretty. It is risky. I would never lie to you. But there's something behind those eyes of yours that screams, I'm the one that can get shit done. Your dad had that same look in his eyes, too. That's why three dogs helping you. Uh, yeah, I can handle it. It's the only problem is I need a lot more ammo. And I'm not talking of uh, I'm not talking about enough to fill my backpack. I mean truckloads of ammo, especially with what what you're ask probably going to ask me to do. But uh, fine, how can one I help? One of the Brotherhood guys that passed through here mentioned seeing a dish in one of DC's old museums. It's the dish off the old Virgo Two lunar lander in the Museum of Technology. I want you to get it and bring it to the Washington Monument to replace the bad one. That's it. Uh, yeah, and it doesn't mention that that's like the center of the freaking super mutant uh, stuff. Granted, there's a couple places that will actually help me out in the process, but... Oh, good lord. Ugh. Oh, Jesus Christ. Dale. <laughs> I sure know how to pick them. You're going to be the best thing that ever happened to Galaxy News in a long time. If you need any more info, I'll be here waiting for you.
So. Yep, all right. All right, three dog. You look like someone with about a million questions. Lay them on me. Okay. Um, you need anything helpful about the museum technology? Ha! <laughs> Man's monument to his own demise. All the garbage they displayed in there is the reason half the world was blown to shit. That shithole is located just off the mall. You know, that huge space in the center of the city in front of the capital. Be careful. The whole place is swarming with super mutants. See, that's what you should have mentioned to me before. Uh, where's the monument? Well, it's only the tallest thing left in the city. When you step out of the museum, take a good look across the mall. You can't miss it. Just be careful. There may still be a security barrier around it. Well, if the Brotherhood's still holding that place, I don't think I'll have to worry about the security. Uh, what's the best way to get the museum? Head out the back door of GNR and take the collapsed car tunnel to the other side of DuPont. Then take the metro tunnels until you're there. Hey, be careful, though. You'll have to find another way back because it's a one-way trip. <sighs> Galaxy News Radio, huh? What is it all about? Without this place, DC would be filled with that crap the Enclave keeps shoveling out of their radio station and festering with muties. Someone's got to tell the Wastelanders what time it is, and Three Dog is the one to do it. No one knows what Eden and his horsemen of the apocalypse are up to, but you can be sure it isn't in the common man's best interest. Uh. Screw needing more ammo. I need better guns. Uh, tell me more about this relay. Well, if you check out your radio, you can hear pretty good in this place. Get a few blocks away, still not too bad. Maybe a little static. Step outside the city limits, and it's Snake City. Nothing but... With the relay back on, you'll hear GNR clearly in the whole Capital Wasteland area like it used to be. So, what's your story? Three dogs seen it all. The Capital Wasteland at its ugliest. People killed for scraps of food. Wounded children wandering aimlessly. Some seriously fucked up shit. If it wasn't for the good fight, I think I would have gone crazy by now. Uh, why bother wa operating it? Why candy coat the news when the world is in danger? People like the Enclave would have you believe everything is calm and totally under control. They're lying. Hell, President Eaton goes around spreading peace, love, and government, but no one even knows how old that Enclave signal really is. People need to hear the truth. It's a harsh world. We've got to work together to make it better, not wait for Uncle Sam to ride in and save the day. And for anyone who's watched probably one of my earlier episodes, you, we actually had the information from a former Enclave soldier that was over in Grey Ditch. And he was wondering who the hell Eden was. So considering that little bit of information, probably a long while. So you're safe up here in your fort or fortress. What do you know about fighting? You've got to understand. If I die, so does the voice of the people. I can't take that risk. Your idea of saving the world means combing through the rubble and using a gun. I use my voice. We're two sides of the same coin. If you think always being a target of your enemies is safe, then you got a funny way of looking at things. It's got a point. I wish I could have met your parents. I bet they were interesting. Parents? Ha! I was born from the sun and have sand in my veins. Ha <laughs> ha! Just messing with you. My parents were very cool. They preached all about the haters and their bullshit, how to tell the propaganda from the real deal. Huh. Let me ask you something else. Okay, go for it. Um, hmm. Well, Three Dog, I guess I'm gonna have to go do this. Right on, right on. Keep your radio tuned to GNR for the real gospel.
Well, here's the thing. As many people know, I don't use the radio in Fallout in any of the games. Why? Uh, one simple reason. Because I really don't want to, uh, really don't want to get any copyright strikes. That was a hell of a fight. And many people don't really use the use the radio function here. But uh, there's a reason why I'm going out this way. And that is actually... Oh, hello. Oh, hello. An assault carbine. All right. We'll take those. And you know what I should do? Just because I know damn well I should. And, oh, oh, I already got that one. I am now going to go around and check, uh, nope, nothing there. I'm going to go check all the uh, Brotherhood people and grab the hollow tags because once I get up uh, later in the game, it's going to be useful. It will definitely be very useful. All right. So, uh, you're probably wondering, what the hell am I going to do? Well, since I now have Galaxy News Radio uh, Waypoint unlocked, I am going to go uh, roll back the Megaton because I feel like it. Oh, lovely. All right. Well, I got to go grab a snooze in my, in my bed until the morning and see if Moira has any more ammo because like always home, I need the money and I also need the ammo uh eight, eight, seven hours at work oh god I'm getting good at that dog meat dog meat seriously boy yeah. Dog meat. Seriously, boy. Get out of my way. Uh, dog meat. Seriously, dog meat. Um, yeah. Just wait here. I know. I know. But, seriously, I, I need to run this solo. Hell, I need to run all of this solo from here on out. There more people like you in the world. I want you to have this. I hope it helps keep you safe. Oh, thank you. Bless you. Hey, Stimpak. Not gonna say no to Stimpaks. All right, rolling up here, getting uh, giving over to Moira's because, well, well, one thing she's gonna talk to ask me about Rivet City. Any luck finding out how Rivet City got started? Uh, I can't get a straight answer. Try asking around a yeah, you know I would if I actually been there. Alright, so. Uh, let's see here. Uh, 20 gauge. Nope, I'm not using 20 gauges. And you have nothing! Oh, boy. You don't even have any stim packs. Alright. The info you're bringing back is... I know, Moira, but... Ugh. I freaking swear sometimes I'm about to lose my damn mind. If I haven't already. Doc, you here? You came in here on your own power, so... Oh, I need medical supplies. And I'm going out and getting shot up, eh? Every damn day. And I'm just going to blast myself with all the cap. That it? And later. Try not to hurt yourself. Unfortunately, Doc, I get shot up every single day. There ain't no way around it. I get shot at every day. Now, 
the one thing I did pick up that I do appreciate is the assault carbine. Unfortunately, I don't have any ammo for it. And uh, quite honestly, uh, yeah, I'm going to wait on getting this. But um, I think I've got... Wait a minute. Hold a minute. Um, let's uh, open this up. I thought I had something. 32 pistol. Chinese. Laser rifle. Oh, wait a minute. I actually have a laser rifle. And then we've got all that and all that. And I don't care. Yeah, it's okay. Right. Um, let's see here. I think I have a laser rifle here. Yes, I do. Yes, I do. I will repair that. And then, and then immediately put it back in my, put it right in there. So, I've got police pistol with two rounds. I've got that, an assault carbine. I'm going to put that away for now. The assault rifle, I still got a decent amount of ammo for that. But I also now have the Chinese assault rifle. And uh, uh, by the looks of things, that looks like the better choice. Combat shotgun, frag grenades. Uh, since I got the combat shotgun, I don't need the short barrel anymore. Uh, yeah. Okay. Um, go. I'm going to uh, roll out here. Oh, wait a minute. I almost forgot. I should go check that other, uh... I should go check the other, uh, things here. things are going well with you today, sir. Oh right, I did move all that to frickin' to my other room, to my other place. Okay. So I'm just gonna go uh roll over to my uh oh, I'm gonna roll over to my uh other building. Abandoned safe house. Uh keep that place locked up. I wonder if they restocked the new bowler. They did. <laughs> Who am I kidding? All right. So at this point in time, I am now going to go over here, and I'm pretty sure I put all the storage stuff here someplace. Oh, it's down here. I forgot. So what am I gonna do? Um. Okay. So there's crafting components here. All right. Now let's see what I can make. Um. Huh. Dark gun, duct tape, paint gun, surgical tubing, and a toy car. I don't think I've gotten any of that. Um, let's see your flame fuel, gas bombs. I know what I can do here. Reloading bench. Um, let's see here. Uh, yeah, break down all that. Oh, hey, look at that. 32 rounds. All right, 308s we need, 32s we need, 357s we need, the 47s and everything else. Uh, nope, we're not going to, uh, wow, they caught, they, 20 gauge? Really? All right, well. So I can make, uh, I can make some 357 rounds. You know what? Why not? And I'll make some 32 rounds because I'm going to need them. I'll make some of those. Okay. That's uh, looking good so far. I thought I had a 12 mil. I thought I had a 12 millimeter. I thought I had a 12 mil pistol, but apparently I don't. Well, um, guess we'll have to go from there. All right, we're heading out of here. Right. And, uh, yep. GNR Plaza. Ah, it's daytime now. I can actually see a little better. Uh, let's see. Um, let's take a look here. Oh, so, rifle. Yeah, you know what? Let's see what they've got here. Uh, 45 auto machine gun. No. Take that. 
and we'll uh, repair that. We will repair that all well, that assault rifle, and then we'll dump that one. So uh, yeah, I'm now going to pick up the Chinese assault rifle because I'm going to need it. And now we go this way. And now we're going around the back way, and we are heading into hell itself. That was a hell of a fight, Mike. All right. So, uh, where am I going from here? And that's a good question. Why don't we go up this way? Oh, there it is. Oh, we're going down this way. Huh? All right. Well, we'll open this door. Yep, down this way. And as soon as I get to the door, yep, it's time. We're going to DuPont Circle. Yep. And it's also time to put the gold mask back on. And we're going that way. We're not going that way, but I'm going to go run over here real quick and grab that freaking... Uh -oh. Hey, what, buddy? Hold on a tick. I have a ghoul mask on. What was your problem? Uh, so where is this lead? Chain gate the Mestro Junction. Okay. So. Apparently, it didn't fool that one. Wait a minute. Yeah, I have the ghoul mask on. What the hell is going on here? Hey, don't mind me, buddies. I'm, I'm out of here. Well, I think this is the perfect time to... Oh, can't use either. Bragging how. All right. Guess I need to deal with this the old-fashioned way. All right. We're not going to deal with anything here because we don't need to deal with that bullshit. Mall outpost. DuPont Circle Station. Oh, yeah. Do I still have that metro ticket on? Do I have that metro ticket? I think I do. I do. I have that metro ticket. Okay. Awesome. Metro Security Terminal. Alright. So, uh... I hear this a little bit... Nope. Um, what about... Uh, if I show my watch. Nope. Uh, that's weird. Yeah, that didn't work. Alright. Back this way, and... Now, this is cruel and unusual punishment, you know that? I'm being very stern on this. Don't make me break shit. God damn it. See? Do I need to punch teeth out? Apparently not. Uh, turn on mask. Call maintenance. Call maintenance and activate the Metro Protectron. There's a reason why I'm doing this. And uh, Metro Security Protocol initializing. Station Security Grid offline. Metro Central. Not threat level. Omega. Oh, Jesus Christ! 
Yeah, gay the Lord Death Park. Love it. For a second there, I thought it was going to be ghouls in here, but nope, it's super mutants. Oh, freaking fantastic. Just the last thing I need right now is more super mutants to deal with. Uh, things I do for freaking GNR, seriously. Right. Okay. Right. That leads. Okay. Go so check that way. No. Nope. Check this way. Oh! Hello, Mr. Raider. Um, how do you like a headshot off? Apparently not very well. Uh, it's not one thing, it's something else. Oh, so that's 22 SMG. I'll take it. File caps, 22 LRs. Alright, let's take a look around and see what he had. Nothing there I care for. However, these things might be a little interesting. Oh, wow. Okay. Uh, three missiles don't feel like dealing with that bullshit. 32 pistol. Bottle of whiskey. More whiskey. I'll take that medical brace, though. Oh. Yeah, well, apparently that buddy ain't gonna be using it anymore, so... Oh. Of course. Can't sleep with enemies nearby. Why am I not surprised? And... Knock, knock! Real smooth, Puma. Real smooth. Oh, wow, all he had was freaking uh, flamer fuel. That's an ammunition box locked and easy. And nothing I care for. Dirty water, Rad X. So oh, I'll take the Rad X and the Rad Way, because that shit's gonna be useful. Uh, let's slow our roll here. Oh, I know what this place is. <laughs> Pardon me a moment. I'm not convicted. Nope. How about I conducted myself with a little bit of pride? Or maybe collected myself a little better? It's time to turn these turrets on the sons of bitches down below. Reconfigure targeting parameters. I'm not hearing anything.
Back of cigs, always worth the money. That's worth it. That's definitely worth it. Island cabinet, two bottle caps, and... Oh, I'm in caution. All right. Wait a minute. I didn't want to press that. All right. Um, deactivate to resistance. There we go. And now we open this door and see how many are left. Thank you. There's usually one, maybe two. Nine mil ammo. Bio cap four, twenty gauge six, single shotgun, and hold twenty gauge. Okay. Another one down here, twenty gauge, and a hole and a cigarette. Okay. Nine mil. Nine mil. Really? Well, let's see what else we can find around here. Because anything further than this point is probably going to end up getting me getting shot. Right. Nothing that way, nothing this way. Hey, look at that. Another freaking duel. Oh, I need the switch. All right. Five, five, six. Hey, no assault rifle. Frag grenades. That's nice. Um, yeah. Anything that I can do here. Be pins. Ball oh, cap. Nine mil rounds. Pins. Metro Central. Dibs on the loop. I'm gonna tear your fucking throat. Didn't even see me coming. You didn't see me coming. You didn't see me coming till you got a bullet in the head. There we go. Well, well. I think we just found a nice little uh, repair point for this. Love it. Ball cap, nine mil. Ooh, love it. So, second assault rifle and repair. Uh, silence ten mil. Repair with uh that pistol. Because I'm pretty sure. Yep, I need that. That's actually a little better used. Okay. Oh, I'll take all that. Oh, 
Okay. And then let's get let's get speech up. Okay. So now um we've got everything we need for that stuff. Let's see what else we've got. Uh, Cyberlimbic. Just good, honest infantry work. You do 20% more damage with 9mm and 45 auto pistols. Quick drop makes all your weapons, equipping, and holstering 50% faster. Scrounger. You'll find considerably more ammunition. Damn fucking tempting. Size matters. Sneering and Pribulous. Strong back. Swing to the fences and stay back. And fight the power. Finesse. Here and now. Nerd Rage. Alright. Well, I've got that, so I'm just going to go Commando, because that sounds like a better idea at the moment. You released t level 10 with good karma. Hey. Oops, impacts. Got a lot of those stim packs. Ball cap. Ball cap. Ball cap. Okay. Looks like uh, everything busted through here like a goddamn. Like a goddamn cycle. Oh, Jesus. Okay. That's a little bit of a rad, a little bit of a radiation problem there. Let's reach this point and go up here. And we're heading towards where we need to go, so we're going to continue this way. Don't see anything. Nope, I don't see anything, uh, anything suspicious at the moment. I still have the ghoul mask on, so as far as I know, the ghouls should not uh, mess with me. But then again, I shouldn't say that too loudly because I've had a random ghoul decide to come and try to nom on my face. So I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna do anything to do. A little too quiet here. That sounds like cool. It is. Nobody saw anything. See, look at me. I'm just a little ghoul. Uh, I'm a ghoul as well. I haven't gone feral yet, but um, it's still going to be fun trying to deal with this bullshit. <laughs> oh, I love these days. I really do. You can tell when the bombs hit, almost everything went right to shit. Alright. So now we'll go this way. Still be my stealthy little self. Gotta try something here. All right. Well, got another. Uh... Oh. Okay. That's a vicious dog dealt with. Oh. Well. Worst time to freaking reload. Well, that's dealt with. This, okay, drowns, 22s. 
Okay. So, oh, and oh, dead raider. I'll take those five, five, sixes. I'm gonna need them when I get to the mall. Ah, door of the museum station. Right. I am now in the metro. All right. Now, memory serves me correctly, there are just schools here. Oh, and somebody here doesn't like me. Nope. Doesn't even know I'm here. Here, just like a little bitch. Hiding from me? Better hope I don't find you. This is gonna be fun. It's showtime. Uh... Hey, buddy, lady, that, that's my ghoul friend there. You can go die. Hey, buddy. Don't mind me. Now, with the junket launcher, I was, always would love to take those freaking cue balls and just start firing them full speed out on these things. That, it was a hilarious time. Oh, did he go back downstairs? Oh, yeah, he did. There, loser. Oh, he went back downstairs. Later, loser. <laughs> okay. So, uh, let's uh, continue on here. I'm going to get to the exit of the metro and... Um, we're going to just uh, roll around here and see what we've got. Yeah, this is most certainly raider territory. And there's a raider right there. What the hell was that boy doing? I took up like three shots and he ran right past me. He says, now you're gonna die. It's like, um, I'm right here, bitch. Hop. Uh. I swear sometimes these people just don't get the idea. Check this way. Roll this way. And over this way. All right. So let's just see how this ends up. Nothing. Okay. And quietly roll. Uh oh. Oh, there'd be somebody over there that's uh just caught a wind of me, and it's like, really? I don't see anybody. Oh, hey, buddy. You want to stick your head out? All right, fine. Pop, pop, pop. Have a seat. Another. Ha! Stand down, boys. Stand down, boys. Don't kill me. Don't kill you. Uh, how about no? <laughs> oh, you raiders are all the same. Oh, what do, what, what do I have? An, I have another caution on me. Nope, I'm nope, I'm clear. Oh, now I'm cautioned again. Why? Or is it this way? I won't be surprised if it's this way. We will we will pull quietly as we can roll up here. Jet. Nope. Open an ammunition box. See if we can get this one. Unlock pretty easy. 
Got it. Uh, 32, more 32 rounds. That works. And that's it. So I'm not buying getting the energy cells. And eight darts. Really? Buff out. I'll take that, though. All right. So I am still in caution. Why? Yeah, I was about to say, I'm not in caution. Right. Museum of Technology and Monuments. And you know what? This is a good time to end this part. Uh, thank you all for uh, for watching. Um, hopefully, uh, part six will be out uh, pretty darn soon. So uh, until next time, you can follow me at Puma Oblivion. Oh, and please also subscribe and thumbs up the video if you actually enjoyed the content. I do try to. I do try my best. Uh, until the next time, folks. Um, when we uh, come back next time, um, I'm walking into hell. And it's not going to be fun. Especially when I got Super Mutant Nightmare to go through. But we're also going to try to see if we can find Underworld. Because another place where I can get ammo and numerous other things, even if it's from ghouls, would not be a bad idea, especially where I am right now. So until next time, folks, see ya.